Strom is not dead. I'm glad that he didn't die. Shin is too powerful. He is so insane. He basically used Megiddo last episode versus Strom. The fight was amazing. Soundtrack, the overall pacing, the animation quality, the fights in this anime, godlike. And I'm glad that Strom actually got away because they kind of build this guy up to be like the big baddie. Then, you, you know, you just kill him immediately. Kind of doesn't really make sense. We have two more new side characters, right? One's like a blacksmith's son. One's like, you know, owns like a restaurant. The family does. And other than that, is there anything we're missing plot wise? I think that's pretty much it. Oh, one thing I want to know is like, I wonder how true Strom's backstory is in regards to obviously his eyes didn't get gouged out, but like he had like Succession War, nobility, stuff like that. Who knows how true that is? Let's begin today's reaction though. Hmm? She taking a piss? She. She. <laughs> when, when, you, when you show me a stream of water like this and she's in. She's gushing like this. What am I supposed to believe? What, what am I supposed to think? WAIT! No! That was a bit day. <laughs> That's wild. That's fucking crazy. That's her bottle getting wiped out. It's, it's insane. Ah, yeah, but it's not even the same thing. あの二人。はい、let's Beanworks, uh, that's the blacksmith, right? Strom. The explosion was not his. Strom。どういうことだ。連兵場で見ただろう。俺の熱光線の魔法は。爆発はしないんだ。あの時の爆発はおそらく俺たちの目をくらますた。シン、攻防に着いたら作りたいものを発注しろ。Really, there's no one else? I guess if we think about power scaling in this show, like, I thought there'd be, like, royal knights and other demon hunters that'd be stronger than Shin. But the power scaling really is, I don't even know how strong Merlin is. Maybe Shin is stronger, I don't know, but it's like, Guru and Merlin probably at top, and then Shin and everyone else. There's no one even close? They could really work on the poster of being like this has got to be the shittiest fucking well back in the day they probably don't have graphical design you know artists and stuff like that and who am i to judge right my production value is also scuffed but that's intentional my logos are intentionally trashed to bring on this authentic you know fucking uh, shitty production value vibe but like this is i think they tried you know it's just like what the fuck <laughs> They're in love. <laughs> daddy, daddy, the fuck you want, dumbass? Alright, boss. Alright, boss, man. <laughs> the crown prince? <laughs> This boy. AU. Very thin blade he wants. Sword, very thin blade. Burusfia Empire Imperial Castle. Is this our empire? Is this a different empire? Different nation? Uh, I don't know. Nanami. Nanami. Evil. 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 Ryuga, Japanese dub. <laughs> My man name is Zest. <laughs> Wonder if he's actually gonna be Zesty when fighting. 
<laughs> I don't need well wishes from a commoner like you. All right, I already hope that Zest kills this king. What a piece of shit. Zest, end him, bro. <laughs> Is it just me? Or did this sign change? We're at 531 right now. Look. Look who changed. Before the the, 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 the hammer wasn't on it. Magic? 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 Huh? Maybe they listened to our criticism. Huh. Oh. <laughs> Probably just talking about love and shit like that, yeah? Yeah, like a necklace, a wedding ring. Mmm, a ring. How about a butt plug? This isn't for, you know, love or romance. We're just trying to protect you, girl. Which, at the end of the day, comes from a place of love. Negative Riz. Negative Riz. Oh, come on. He, all he tried to do was protect her. Now he's getting shit on for it because of the misleading. That's on her. That's on her, bro. Negative Riz. Can we just buy this girl just jewelry right off the bat? Okay. Get her a choker. Oh. I mean, it's an isekai. Where's the slave collar at? Get her a fucking slave collar like a nephew, bro. What if there was a slave collar just amongst the fucking jewelry? Which finger? Which finger? Which finger are you putting this on? Hmm? <laughs> the fourth. The middle? Does the middle count as an engagement ring? I actually don't know the placements. I know the fourth finger is wedding ring. But is middle engagement? I don't know how that works. You don't know? You, yeah, why am I asking Chad? You bunch of fucking girlfriendless ver- I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, never been engaged either. How would I know? How would you know? Oh. Now, this probably is a flag in itself. Like, the ring will protect her. Maybe evil forces are gonna fuck her up, and then the ring somehow clutches? We haven't even put an enchantment on it yet, have we? I think symbolically it's supposed to keep her protected, but like, we gonna enchant that shit or what? Oh, here we go. Award ceremony. Gonna get some kind of medal. Some prestigious medal. Oh, Jesus! Oh! Damn, they were ready for this. Uncle this! Wonder if by the end of the season, if he's just gonna keep like collecting more medals to the point he's gonna look like a boy scout with like 12 separate fucking badges all over his uniform. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And here you are, propping him up. Alright, this. We're gonna keep it down low. <laughs> what was that? Mmm. And then transition into a manga panel. Mmm. Uncle Dis, you're looking pretty cool. I don't think Uncle Dis has any ill intentions, like, to exploit Shin for his political gains either. I think he's genuinely good and just wanted to reward him because word got out and we have to acknowledge that, but we're keeping it down low. Unless Uncle This is the mastermind behind us all. No, I don't think so. I don't think so. They just flipped the guards. Paparazzi, call the guards! Yeah, where's the security at? <laughs> Booba! Oh! <laughs> Immediately, as soon as we use the wormhole, boing! Hello! Yeah, surprised me too. 
It's a wormhole. Don't worry about it. Not teleportation. Mm -hmm. So the mechanics of this is basically, I'm sure you guys already know, but like teleportation is, you know, yourself going from one location point A to point B. Just physically moving like that by just removing yourself, boom, position gone, and then pop, position there. But a wormhole is like two set of portals, a gate that exists that you kind of just walk in the gate and you walk out the other gate. How is how's that different from teleportation? Like, my, my uh, explanation there, right? A gate is simply you walk into a gate and it's already linked to another, you know, the, from point A to point B. But teleportation is you are physically moving from point A to point B without a gate. And that's not a good enough explanation. Spatial distortion? I feel like there's got to be a better way to explain what a teleport and a gate is. Relocation magic. That's a pretty good way to put it. Getting from point A to point B. Reduces the distance between two locations. Yeah, that's a probably better way of explaining it, right? Basically reducing wormhole, right? From the gates, it's basically instead of point A to point B being this distance, that distance become nothing using a wormhole. Direct flag that she will use it, right? Skimichi Mula Fantasy, Makoto training arc incoming. These students, bro, push him to the limits. They're gonna get so cracked though after getting taught by Shin. Boot camp time? Boot みんながある程度の攻撃と防御の魔法を使えるようになる。Just basic level ups. Get them enchanted. Wonder who's the best here at controlling magic. Shin is probably explaining in terms that no one can understand because he's so talented and it just makes sense to him, but to everyone else, it's going through textbook ways and it's not making sense, right? Level up. Let's go, bidet girl. Trash, break it. Boom. Telling me that a ring has a better barrier? Holy shit! Two layer barrier! No way! Very ping ping! Okay. Just magic protection wall? Yes, flex, flex, go. Nani! This pressure! Oh, Veldora's magicules! <laughs> Shit's like fucking hockey or something. Everyone just falls to their fucking knees, bro. They like, have problems breathing. <laughs> I don't think anyone can do that. How strong will our ultimate magic club become? Okay, the other empire again. Strom. So Strom is from the other kingdom. This is maybe some partial truth about his backstory. So Strom is there. The other Zeska is there. They're about to start a war. Okay, media. <laughs> Zest Media Strom. <laughs> so, what do you think is happening here, right? Like, b beyond the serious stare from Media, which makes me think that maybe she's not on the good side, like, how do you think, like, this scene ends? So, like, Media just standing here, bro looks out the window and goes, like, <laughs> 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 do you think that just, he just slowly stops, you know, laughing and goes, <clears throat> You can leave now, Media. And Media goes, yes, sir. That was very cringe. <laughs> the fuck is the flower coming from? What is that look from Maria, bro? So many teeth. 
<laughs> that is so many. Okay, so this time, like, everyone got some seats here, too. Because, like, remember last time I was making fun of, like, the other lesser known characters here where they were had to sit in the fucking corner while everyone had the couch? They have, like, these, like, temporary seats now. Look at the amount of teas on the table. Holy shit. Jesus Christ. What are more couches, bro? Kind of. Indirect students. This, they're being talking a lot about this magic visualization. Basically imagining the magic. So, normal people think about what the final product will look like. A fireball, I'm envisioning the fireball. The actual ball being thrown. But he thinks about all the different steps to get to the fireball and that's why he's so OP. <laughs> Fuck, I don't know, that's high school science. <laughs> do you know? Do you know why a fire burns? Um, because you set it on fire? She's right. Is she wrong? She's right. <laughs> True? <laughs> Chemistry, high school, I don't know. <laughs> Oh, what the f- <laughs> Bro didn't know either. <laughs> I don't know either. Uh, it's something about like combustion and like constant, I don't know, feeding of oxygen and the- I forget, it's, it's just like- This is like fucking grade 8 science, bro. I've, it's been a long time since science school. I don't remember this shit, man. The process. He's not limited to the end product. He thinks about what the end product will become later by the process. Ji chan got a gate! He did it! Cool. Now, I wonder how we're gonna learn how to float because that's the thing that Strom had last episode that we made a comment on and Shin was like, shit, even I don't know how to float yet. Oh my god, she is so big. Yuri, I mean. マリン、あんたもたまにはいいことをするじゃないか。たまにとは何じゃ。ダメだろ?何のことじゃ?よそ he wants to be more relatable instead of being outcasted as a monster. No, I'd say that because Merlin and Shin is the only one that can do it, those two are special cases. I don't know, if some normie fucking used it, then I'd be like, yeah, he'd be more normal. But like, you tell me only the fucking great sage Merlin and Shin can do it? Yeah, others will see that only legendary historical figures can do it. What happened to her? The fuck? Yeah, blew up in your face. Her glasses are cracked too. Alright. Lin's pretty strong, huh? Like, strong minded. Kind of chuny too. Yo! They changed it again! The fu- Maybe. You got a lot of different advertising. This time it's an axe. Before it was a broadsword, it wasn't colored, and they... What the? They keep, they keep switching it up on me, man. What the fuck? Oh, come on. Oh, come on! We're so close to the end! Fuck you, VLC player. Restart. Here. Let's go. Oh, the sword will go flying, right? It's a detachable thing. <laughs> what are we gonna do? I feel like this is gonna be so funny in a battle where it's just like, we have a sword. Beep! And the blade just goes... It's a pretty goofy weapon, but it could be really funny. You can come up with it, yeah. Everyone gets a ring? She was relieved there that it was not like a personal, you know, reward. <laughs> no Ikemen. No Ikemen. No, no BL wife with hus husband. No fucking look at these dudes, bro. I had the flowers ready and everything, bro. They got the pose down. <laughs> Our army's gonna get stronger. 
改良は必要だが大量生産すればトニーだからトニーがいいなら Yo like Tony straight up should be getting paid like so much he's about to become a billionaire if they're gonna be willing to give him like the royalties because he came up with this patent this is his idea and if the entire empire soldiers are going to be mass reproducing like these swords for them the amount of money that tony will collect will be insane but i don't know if they're gonna you know go like that <laughs> the other kingdom so we are a kingdom but brusfia is an empire what is the difference between a kingdom and an empire? An empire I know as is, you know, they have an emperor and then they have many, you know, big houses underneath them. It's a huge nation where the empire rules, but there's, you know, big nobles beneath them. That kind of makes it the whole structure. A kingdom just has a king, which is basically an emperor, but doesn't have nobles underneath. I don't know how that works. There's no noble houses. It's just a kingdom has one king and everyone else is pretty much like lower status. I, I don't know. An empire has control over smaller kingdoms. So is it fair to say that we are within this empire? No, we're a complete different nation. But interesting. Okay. Let's go to war. I shouldn't be laughing about kids being enlisted into war because that's a horrible nightmare of a reality. But in this anime show, send these kids in. Cap. Cap. 100% this will happen. Whether or not he gets dragged in or, you know, he steps up, you know, voluntarily, he is gonna be the determining factor of who wins this war. Yeah. Alright. Now imagine... Imagine, in a separate alternate reality, where my tinfoil theories are true, that Uncle Dis planned this from the beginning, knew that they were outmatched against the Burusfia Empire, knew that he needed a, a trump card, had a paid actors, every one of these kids are paid actors from the beginning, to form around Chin, to make him feel so like, make him feel like he has a sense of community and a belonging here, so that he will act on his own accord to fight against the Empire. Imagine. Imagine everyone here was a fucking paid actor. Now, that's not the case. I don't think so. They're all genuinely good people. And Shin's found new friends that he wants to, you know, protect. But, like, imagine Uncle Dis from the beginning. This is his plan. <laughs> Post-credit scene? So, the Uncle Dis? Uncle and that is today's episode of Wise Man Grandchild. And what was the point of today's episode? It was a bit of setup, right? We had obviously pop off episode with Strom, and now we're going around trying to get, you know, accessories for our girlfriend to be and the sword that we wanted. And then more training arc for our students and understanding how Shin visualizes the process of the magic rather than other people visualizing the outcome of the magic, which helps him overcome limitations. There's huge paparazzi, you know chasing him because he's now you know heralded as like the hero of this nation we get to see more new characters from the other empire so strom was from this other empire i'm gonna assume that he is nobility here there is a maid there is a guy named zest media Medis, i think and uh strom and we also know the enemy no i don't really know the brusfia empire emperor Zest was more important than the Emperor. The Emperor seems to be just a piece of shit that's uh, getting used as a tool by Zest. So we'll be, it'll be interesting to see what happens. Now, even though we have, you know, we got all these new weapons and enchantments, I'm sure Shin is going to be like the defining factor on who wins this war. And he'll probably step in by himself. But again, just imagine if Uncle Dis planned all this shit for Shin to take action because he knew that he couldn't win without him. Just my head cannon. That's it for me. If you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for more content, and until next time, take care.